What's up, y'all? We back in here with another Fox reaction, man. It's mine's the future. And sadly, this is the end of the marathon. The end of the marathon. <laughs> okay. All right, so we're on disc two, all the works of nature which adorn the world. Um, <clears throat> which is it's the, the main title. It, originally, it was supposed to be one long uh, song, just different sections. Yeah. So, but they went ahead and split them up into two full disc albums. I like that. Album. So, it's a cool thing. I like that. So, we're going to check them all um, out in this video right here. We're just going to do all of these in one video because we heard that they're like instrumentals that have like spoken word parts yeah. maybe some background just a little bit of background vocals you know something like that so we just decided that this is one big long thing it's supposed to be together anyway so we're just going to do it that way but uh this could average from about 35 minutes to an hour depending on how much we talk because we're going to talk a little bit uh we're going to listen to the audio and then talk after each audio yeah in between each song we're, we're not going to pause the audio at all because i feel like i'd mess up the well there's thing. yeah these are all between like two and a half to five minutes so all in all this is going to be like around 31 minutes full of us doing this At song least. but we're going to talk in between so this is probably going to be about a 40 minute video if not a little longer all right you ready to get into this man we got first up we got vista, vista. all right let's do this here you go you ready three two one go there is a pleasure in the pathless woods. There is a rapture on the lonely shore. There is society oh, where none intrudes by the deep sea and music in its roar. I love not man the less, but nature more. It's kind of a build up for the rest of the album. There she is.
Oh, see? Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa! Chill. Okay, so... Vista... That was more, uh, a setup. Yeah, for the rest but, like I was telling you before, these are all supposed to go together, so they do slide into one another. Yeah, probably so. So that's cool. Um... This is called The Blue. The next one coming up. Uh, Vista was more of a... It was really uh, peaceful. Yeah, it was. It had more of a build-up section, though. Um, and, and more of an introduction for the rest of this, which is always a cool thing. Um, and I love Floor's background vocal. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure they said um, the girl that was talking at the front, mm -hmm. it was either Floor mm -hmm. or it was Thomas's wife. I think someone said it was Thomas's wife. I don't Curtin. think it's Floor's uh I think it's Thomas's voice. wife. Correct me if I'm wrong on that, but I think that was Thomas's wife. But I like the way that it said, uh, I I love not man less, but nature more. Yeah. That's a cool concept. Are you ready to get into this one? Yeah, this is called The Blue. The Blue, The Blue, The Blue. Aye. Ready for this? Three, two, one, go. Let's get it. Ugh. Very calm and soothing. 
but they had a it's kind of like a build up too I like the way that uh, the way the drums were and the them putting the cello in there was very uh, cool I love the cello sound yeah that's I that, that was. That's that mm-hmm. instrument that sounds uh, kind of like a giant violin, but it's really yeah. deep sounding. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's a cello. Those are really cool. They're supposed to, okay, that's originally what a bass was. Oh, okay. So that's what, if you ever listen to bass, how it's real deep toned, that's yeah. basically, it's a, called an upright bass or a cello. So that song was called The Blue. Once again, it's really peaceful. Um, at the end, you could hear birds, water, like the ocean. And birds, which are in the sky. Yes. Um, so that was definitely about like the sky, like the like oceans and stuff like that. Yeah. So the green has to be about like, the earth and yeah, stuff, land, probably. Yeah. You ready to get into it? Oh yeah, let's do this. It's Go called on. the green. The green. He didn't got me locked in now. Thomas is a deep composer. Three, two, one, go. Oh, this is different. Sounds darker. I love the sound. Bringing the chimes in. So dark though. And then it brightens up like it's a bipolar song. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay. Huh. That one, so far. That was my favorite one. That's my favorite one on this, uh, this two so far. I love the sound of it. Like, yeah, same for me. The way favorite. that these mesh together, you could put this in a a movie and just play it in the background, like Lord of the Rings. It's like a it's okay, it's a period piece movie. It's based in medieval time. Um, just the sounds that they're going for. You could stick in the background of that those movies, and it would just completely go with it. It, it sounds per. It's beautiful. It's perfect. That was a killer. I, I love that one though. That's probably my favorite one so that, far. That was my favorite one. There wasn't any sound effects in that one that like signified like land or anything like that. Like no, it didn't. But it was kind of for me. Like I said, it was kind of bipolar because it kept going kind of yeah. really deep and dark, and then it would just brighten up out of nowhere. And I, yeah, that's, that's weird. I was into that one. All right, this one is called Moors. Moors, yeah. Moors, okay. So we're going to get right into this one. You ready? Let's get it. Three, two, one. Let's get it. Oh, oh here it comes. Get off my screen. Oh! Ooh! Come back, Bob! Look! When you play bad bagpipes and make them sound like a saxophone, untouchable. Cause that's what I thought at first, which I thought would be very weird. Oh. Remember what I said about the last one being my favorite? That opinion has changed already. <laughs>
Okay. Alright, so, uh... I'm not sure what Moors means. Yeah, tell us down below in the comments what Moors means. But, that one's my favorite on this, too. I still like the green. I like the green. All of them are so peaceful. They're all so good, but this one has... It's different. You about to make me fall asleep. I know, you could sit and play it in the background and you could fall asleep to it. But this one is just... There was more energy all over the place. Like, it was kind of, you know, soothing with the, the bagpipes. And then all of a sudden, bam, here comes this drumming. And then more bagpipes. And then mix a little bit of this and that. In there. It, I, it's beautiful. I don't know what else to say about That's it. That's correct. You, you're correct there, buddy. You, you are right. <laughs> you see what I got to put up with? <laughs> Man, we've been filming... We stayed up late. We've been editing, filming, making thumbnails all day. All for you. Let's see what we got. We got four more left. And this one's uh, Aurora? Aurora? Aurora Ray. That's how we go. Wait, say what? It. How's, how's Aurora spelled? Aurora? Let's spell it, I think. Actually, is that Aurora? I don't know. I don't know, but we're going to get right into this. We're going to look up how it's pronounced. It I think that's Aurora. Um, we're going to find out. We're going to find out. Yeah. We're going to get on up out of here. It's only a two minute one. Um, let's see here. Aurora sounds like a dark name. If that's where it is. Pronunciation. Is that how you spell that? Mm -hmm. Aurora. Aurora. Arari. 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 I'm gonna call me Arari. <laughs> um. Arari. Well, this one's a little over two minutes. This is the shortest one, I believe, on here. All right, yeah, it is. But let's get into it. Let's get into this one. We're going to keep on keeping on. Like, like my guy says down in the comments. I'll see you. Keep on keeping on. Yeah. <laughs> All right, three, two, one. Let's get it. I knew it was going to be dark. I think it's gonna be evil, and then here comes this pretty stuff. Mm. That touched it right in my head. Drastic change. I feel like I'm on an adventure to save the princess. Change it up on me like that. Okay. A bomb dropped on that one. So, let me take this off for a second. When you want to be sporadic, <laughs> let's listen to that one. Because that one started out really dark, and it just got... It went darker. 
all happy all over the place and then dark again and just like this was gone quiet as the snow i thought i was on an adventure during that one now this is not the most peaceful one on the track by the name of it i think this is going to be peaceful quiet as the snow quiet as the snow it's possible we better check it out we better find out yeah how are you enjoying this this too so far? Dude, I like it. Um, uh, which ones are your favorite so far? The green and Ori, I think. Is that how you say it? Ori? Oh, Arari. Arari. That one, yeah. The green, Moors, and Arari right now are like my top three for this, but that they're, they're all good. It's such a hard thing. When we do the album review for this, it's gonna be so hard. It is gonna be And so I thought about something cool. What if they would have incorporated this because I know they're short enough. What if they were to put these like in between each song on the, the first disc? That would have been kind of lit, too. That would have been cool, too. But I understand why they didn't. They wanted this to be its yeah, own but, side. Yeah, because one side's human, and then this yeah. one's the nature side. And then they wanted to put everything together. So I understand why they didn't do that. But that would have been something cool they could have played you know, with, with it. That would have right. been awesome. Let's get into this one, man. Yes, sir. Quiet as the snow. 360. That's you getting a like. 361 discs. Or 361 likes, nine dislikes. How many dislikes? None. People are dumb. Facts. Are you ready? Yes. Three, two, one. Let's get it. Go. Okay. So it's starting off peaceful. I don't think so. I don't know, they might be, but they're whispering so low that I can't really uh, make out what they're saying. Yeah, they're in a different language. I heard one word.
Okay, so that one was more of the quieter ones. Um, <laughs> Jail ad. Uh oh, fried pickle. Uh, uh, that was. Uh, I like how they incorporated the uh, like the weird vibe to the beginning with the uh, the like the whispering. Oh yeah, and, and then, then they had off. And then later on, later they went on. like choir. Yeah, a little bit. I like that a lot. What, bro? My hair going crazy? Yeah. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> um, that one was a lot quieter. I liked it though. It's kind of creepy, the special, the whispering. So this one is called Anthropocene. An Anthropocene. Anthropocene, yeah. Including. Hurry and him of Nikai. Oh, okay. To Nikai. Uh, uh, nickel. That's nickel. Nickel? Something like that. We'll pronounce these the best we can. I, from over here, I'm way over here. I'm looking at the screen. I ain't got my glasses on. Uh, <laughs> Hurry and him of nickel. Uh, we got this. Uh, we got two more left. Oh, yeah. Add Astra's the last one in here. Yeah. All right, man. Let's get into it. All righty. Man, I'm sad. We're getting close to the end. Yeah, we are. We're going to do more series like this. Yeah. Right, yes, go. we do. Put your headset on, boy. Ready? Right, ready? Three, go. two, one, go. Oh, the last track went into this one. Yeah. That was weird. That was weird. Uh, that did not feel like three minutes either. No, it was, it was fast. All right, so this is the last song. Ad Astra. This has a lot of meaning behind it because this was in Shoemaker, I think. 
Yeah. Um, it was uh, the one of the terms that popped up that we looked up, which means uh, all the stars. What? Yeah, all the stars, yeah. So, uh, this is the closing of this album. This one right here is going to be crazy. I know it already. <coughs> it should be. It's going to be crazy. To close the album out, I think it should be. But, even if it is soothing almost the whole way through, it's it's a masterpiece of uh, instrumental. I'm not a big fan of instrumentals, but this one, it like, it's an experience. And if it was all one big piece of music, which if they perform this one live, I believe they would probably do that. Or they'd just throw one in here and there, you know what I mean? But if they perform this whole disc too, as a whole, um, you'll see that every song flows into one another. And I love that. Um, I think this is not as appreciated as it should be because this right here has 9,000 views. Okay, The main songs have like 100K almost already. Yeah. So let me tell you something. If you're a Nightwish fan and you're watching this right now, go, just go listen. Put some headphones on just listen. I'm buying this album. Just listen. Just It's crazy. Look, support your artist. Support your favorite band. Look, without people like us or you that love them, supporting them and buying their albums and music, they won't be able to do what they love to do. Thomas, is a, he's a master. He's a genius. If he composed all, like... If he wrote all this wrote, like, and had an orchestra and do this, mm. he's genius. He's genius anyway. But I've never, as many artists as I listen to, I've never found anyone that is the, as like, lyrically, uh, compositionally genius as him. He just... That's I don't know. No track. wonder it took five years to make yeah. this album. Let's get on to this last track, man. We're closing it out. Ad Astra. Ad Astra. Are you ready? Yep. Three, <laughs> God. Three, two, one. Let's get it! Oh! <laughs> Yeah. 
Like the ending of a movie. Yeah. I love this. Should have been the Lion King. That right, that right there, you could just feel like nature sounds around you. That was amazing. Man, that, that's my favorite one. That one? Yeah. I like, that one yeah, that great. one was amazing. Oh my goodness, no! The marathon is over! How long is the video? Not all the way. Albums. Not exactly. Because we'll be back tomorrow. With the album review. With the full album review. And we'll have another video tomorrow too, because we're on the grind and we ain't stopping. Yes, sir. No sleep. No, sir. Yeah. Big boy gotta have his sleep. I right, y'all, man. Amazing Hope album. It though. was amazing. Yeah, yeah. Amazing, but All we I will can say get is masterpiece. We will get into how we feel about this whole album as a whole, both discs. Uh, tomorrow on the album review, I'm gonna try to go out and find a copy tonight, mm. if I can find a copy. Because I'm going to support this band fully now. Because I love what they do. 12 dislikes? Who are you? Those haters that get on our videos. <laughs> okay, buddy. <laughs> Alright, y'all. This video is at 47 minutes almost. That's going to be all for this video, man. Be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe. Do all that good stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And click the bell. And y'all know. What we do with the crew. MOTF gang. I'm going to bed. We'll see y'all in the next video, man. Peace. Yeah. Next marathon. Peace. <laughs>